Welcome to this short introduction video for the Spark, the incredibly versatile product from the Cybex equipment range, designed for interval training, specifically HIT. This video has been created to support you to be able to educate others onto the product in relation to the key features and benefits of the Spark and the exercise of training options and the emotions that may occur within them. With this movement pattern borrowed from the art trainer, the product supports the exerciser in a safe, non-impact training environment that may provide the feeling of security with the ability to go at sub-maximal or maximal intensities. Meta-analysis of the research conducted by the Cybex Research Institute uh, determined that on a modified Borg scale of 1 to 10, an intensity of 7 is sufficient to achieve the physiological gains targeted in interval training. Combine this with a non-impact lower knee stress movement pattern and you have an easy to use tool that may be appropriate for a number of different population groups. The setup is so simple as the foot plates do not lock and the incline can be adjusted to three different levels. At the moment we have it set on level three, we can drop it back to level two, or we can go all the way back to level one. With the setting in the lowest level right here, you can specifically determine great work on the glutes and the hamstrings. Now that's not to say that the quadriceps are not engaged, it is that they will be challenged less because of less flexion at the knee. With the incline in the mid position, the recruitment of the quads increases as there is a greater level of flexion occurring at the knee. When the incline is placed in the highest level though, the grading of the knee extensors increases again. Now with regard to the body position, the user can choose to stand upright unsupported, they can hold on or they can get down into a sled position and re drive down onto those foot plates. Now, when the user pushes down on the foot plate, the other one is pushing up and that will want to raise the user up. And by actually locking in and driving down, they may be able to generate a higher wattage. The fan base resistance is also engaged at all times and works off the principles that the faster you go, the harder the resistance will get. This enables the user to generate a large amount of power and this is demonstrated from their power wattage output. Now, there is an additional eddy current brake just on here, which has levels of 1 to 10. So on level 1, it's pretty much disengaged. It's not going to add much additional resistance. However, when you start cranking it up, it gives you more and more. Now, the amount of extra wattage you'll be able to generate as a result of that will be determined by how fast your movement of your legs are. Now, finally, there's the console. Now the setup on this is incredibly simple. If the user gets on and starts moving and presses the go button, the console defaults into circuit mode, where the work completed is recorded and the clock will continue to run for several minutes before switching off. So I can get off the product and do something else. And this may be great for a number of uh, different exercises. In terms of accessibility in a group setting, this product will work exceptionally well uh, where short rest periods are being utilized. As there is no setup such as adjusting a saddle or moving a foot strap, the product enables the user to switch swiftly from one exercise to another. Should the exerciser wish to complete intervals on the product, they can get on and press interval. This then allows the exerciser the opportunity to adjust the work to rest ratio in 10 second increments. When the session is done, only the work completed is recorded, so the exerciser gets a true indication of what they have achieved. From a technicality perspective, the, the user only needs to push down and back, and therefore, in terms of a skill development side of things, the spark is incredibly easy to use. Unlike doing box jumps, squatting, deadlifting, or driving an actual sled, where you have to learn the technique and you have to think about where you're driving, where you're pushing the foot, with this, you can get on in a safe, comfortable learning environment. So why should someone want to engage with the Spark? Well, simply put, this product can be for any, anyone. Whether they are an elite athlete seeking high uh, level power output, right the way through to a rehability or a new to exerciser who is seeking an exercise medium that is non-impact. This places less stress on the knee and does not require a great deal of skill. So let's discuss a few exercises and who may wish to utilize the product. Well, we mentioned the sports performer a moment ago, and they may be seeking a challenge at a high intensity where they can work maximally, or maybe just below, in an environment that is unlikely to injure them. As there is limited skill involved with these level foot plates, no matter how fatigued the user gets, they can feel confident and secure with the consistency and capability of the machine. 
This means that they can challenge themselves uh, in this safe environment and know that uh, nothing's going to move, nothing's going to change for them. So they can really push themselves. Secondly, the regular exerciser who enjoys the exercise environment and social aspects of going to the gym. For this exerciser, there is, this is a product that can challenge them over a short period of time, such as maybe completing Tabata sessions. If they're more into their group training though and that community environment, they can complete a circuit with others that can be both challenging, varied and safe while not being too technically demanding. For this user, the emotions that they may experience may include self-accomplishment or the joy of working out with others. Finally, there is the new or returning to exerciser. Now for them, the Spark may uh, provide this safe environment where they can increase their confidence and their fitness levels at a slower rate. They don't have to learn a great deal of skill so it's not too technical and in terms of the physical challenge, it depends how hard they go as to uh, how challenging it will be for them. So, for any form of circuit training or interval training, the Spark is a great tool that will both excite and challenge a wide variety of exercises. We hope that you found this video useful and enlightening.